Demand for getting a COVID vaccine in Louisiana is now going down. The state ranks in the bottom six when it comes to the percentage of people vaccinated. We understand that many people might have some questions about the shot. Lots of them left over. So on tonight's Vax Facts, Meg Ferris answers those most asked vaccine questions. For our answers, we turn to Tulane vaccinologist Dr. Lisa Marisi. Question one, is it okay to take an over-the-counter pain medication, you know, like Tylenol or Advil, before the vaccine, just in case there's side effects like fever, headache, or injection site discomfort? Answer, take them after the shot. If you're going to have side effects, that won't happen for hours, so there's plenty of time to take one afterwards. Question two, if I already had COVID, should I bother getting a vaccine? Answer, yes, you should still get vaccinated. The protection from the vaccine is robust and consistent across age groups, race, ethnicity, and gender, while the immune response to the wild virus is highly variable, and we still don't know how long natural immunity lasts. Question three, can I still get COVID after I've been vaccinated? Answer, yes, the vaccines are highly effective, but not 100%. So some rare breakthrough cases are expected. But with more than half a million people vaccinated in Louisiana, only 126 breakthrough cases have been found. And remember, their illness is likely to be much milder and shorter. In people not vaccinated, there is potential for severe and long-lasting health problems. Question four. How long does vaccine immunity last? Answer, the new Moderna New England Journal of Medicine information shows protective antibodies are still strong after six months, but how long that will last is still unknown. It's likely that vaccine immunity is going to last a lot longer, but six months is the longest we have study data on so far. For VaxFax, I'm Meg Farris. So here's another tip. If you had COVID and got a treatment with either monoclonal antibodies or convalescent plasma, the CDC says you should wait 90 days before you get the vaccine.